China has long been known as a global leader in high-speed transportation technology. From their successful implementation of extensive high-speed rail networks to their development of various new technological innovations, China continues to push the boundaries of what is possible in transportation. One of the latest innovations being tested is a low-vacuum magnetic levitation maglev, transportation system. The first full-scale test of this system was recently conducted in Shaanxi province, northern China, and the results are very promising. What is maglev technology? Maglev, short for magnetic levitation, is a technology that allows trains to float above the tracks using magnets. Since there is no direct contact between the train and the tracks, the friction that typically slows down conventional trains is almost entirely eliminated. As a result, maglev trains can achieve much higher speeds compared to traditional trains. This technology was first developed in the mid-20th century, and since then, various countries around the world have tested and implemented maglev systems, though still on a limited scale. The maglev test in Shaanxi province, China, is a significant step in the development of this transportation technology. The system has been jointly developed by China Aerospace Science and Industry Corporation Limited, CASIC, and the Shaanxi provincial government. This test involved a superconducting maglev vehicle moving within a 2-kilometer long pipeline network. What makes this test unique is the use of a low vacuum tube, meaning that most of the air inside the tube has been removed, reducing air resistance that could slow down the vehicle. During the test, the maglev train demonstrated controlled navigation, stable suspension, and safe stopping. Additionally, the vehicle successfully maintained balance even while navigating curves, which is a significant technical challenge in maglev development. In other words, the test results show that this technology has reached a significant level of maturity and is ready for further development. Speed and energy efficiency One of the primary advantages of maglev technology is its speed. In this test, the maglev train was able to reach speeds of up to 621 miles per hour, 1,000 kilometers per hour. This speed far surpasses that of current high-speed trains, which typically operate at speeds between 200 to 300 kilometers per hour. If this maglev technology is successfully implemented on a large scale, it would mean that travel between major cities in China, such as Beijing and Shanghai, could be completed in about 1.5 hours. In comparison, the same journey currently takes over two hours using high-speed trains. In addition to speed, maglev technology also offers advantages in terms of energy efficiency. Because there is no friction between the train and the tracks, the energy required to propel the maglev train is much lower compared to conventional trains. Moreover, this technology is free from chemical byproducts and significant noise pollution, making it a more environmentally friendly option. Potential economic and social impact The large-scale implementation of maglev technology could have significant economic and social impacts. From an economic perspective, reducing travel time between major cities can boost productivity by allowing people to travel faster and more efficiently. It could also open up new economic opportunities, particularly in areas that were previously less connected to major economic hubs. From a social perspective, reducing travel time can also improve quality of life by providing people with more leisure time. Additionally, since this technology is more environmentally friendly, its implementation could help reduce the negative impacts of air and noise pollution in urban areas. Challenges and future prospects Despite the promising results of the maglev test in Shaanxi, there are still several challenges that need to be addressed before this technology can be implemented on a large scale. One of the biggest challenges is the cost of developing and constructing the necessary infrastructure. Building long vacuum tube networks and maintaining vacuum conditions on a large scale will require a substantial investment. Additionally, there are technical challenges in ensuring that this technology can operate reliably under various weather and environmental conditions. However, despite these challenges, the future prospects for maglev technology remain bright.
With the support of the Chinese government and ongoing technological advancements, it is highly likely that we will see commercial implementation of this maglev system. If successful, this could revolutionize the way we think about long-distance transportation. The maglev train test in Shaanxi province, China, is a crucial step in the development of high-speed transportation technology. With the ability to reach speeds of up to 1,000 km per hour and offering numerous advantages in terms of energy efficiency and environmental friendliness, this technology has the potential to transform the way we travel long distances. Although there are still challenges to overcome, the results of this test show that the future of maglev technology is very promising. As a country that continues to push the boundaries of technological innovation, China once again demonstrates that they are at the forefront of developing future transportation solutions. With government and industry support, as well as a strong desire to become a global leader in technology, it is no surprise that we will see more developments in maglev technology in the coming years. The Shaanxi test is just the beginning of what could be a revolution in global transportation. Maglev technology, which was once just a scientific concept, is now becoming a reality thanks to collaborative efforts between governments, industries, and scientists around the world. The Shaanxi test is a concrete example that this technology is not only possible but can also be